is are the leaves too much or is it like a cute little aesthetic we'll keep them in Nikki and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new and in today's video as you can tell by the title and by my background <laughs> I'm gonna be going ahead wait sorry I'm cold I'm so cold I can't even think right now I'm gonna be trying out some new skincare today and as you can tell by the title that skincare is fresh I was gifted this box filled with items and I thought hey why not film a video trying them? Um, Fresh is a very popular brand and I'm really excited to try it out. You know, I haven't tried Fresh yet, so I'm gonna go ahead and get into this little box. So in here, I have a little bit of the Rose Deep Hydration Oil Infused Serum. Boom. I have the infamous Fresh Soy Face Cleanser. I'm so excited to try this. I love my Murad, but it's good to have, you know, another one on standby, so we'll see. I have the Rose Deep Hydration Facial Toner, which can't wait to try. And lastly, I have the Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream, strengthening uh, mask road and duo of hyaluronic acids. And a cute little scrunchie in here. So maybe I'll use that for my hair instead of this one, even though this one's really cute. So I'm going to basically go ahead and get into reviewing the product. So I'm going to quickly just take off my makeup using my Patrick Stars One Size Beauty face wipes and also the face uh, go off dissolving mist because these two together are a dream. And I'll come back to you guys in a second. Okay, so my makeup is removed and I just realized that this works as also a face a face remover, a makeup remover, but we'll go ahead and see what it does if there's any excess makeup on my skin. So first, to start off my skincare routine, I'm basically putting these products in order as I would use the products that I already use. So first, we're going to start off with the Fresh Soy Face Cleanser. This is for all skin types. It's rich in amino acids and it gently cleanses face and eyes. I'll read you um, what it says about it on the Ulta Beauty website and I'll put it here on the screen too. So. This basically says this is a non-stripping pH balanced gel cleanser that is close to skin's natural pH level, making it gentle for all skin types. Uh, it also has a toning effect because of amino acid rich soy proteins and rose water. It's 100% reportedly to thoroughly remove face makeup, um, universally loved for the way it removes stubborn makeup, mascara without drying, soft and hydrating skin. Key ingredients include amino acid rich soy proteins which help maintain skin's elasticity. Common cucumber extract aids in soothing the skin. Rose water is notable for its calm and balancing properties which I love for the skin. I absolutely love rose water. I used to always get like those little rose water um, spray bottles from like TJ Maxx Marshalls. Oh, I used to stock up on them. I need to do that again because my skin was glowing. And lastly, um, borad seed oil to help nourish and soften. So, wet skin and massage over face and eyes, then rinse. So, let's go ahead and do so. So, I'm going to wet the skin a bit. I probably should have grabbed it like out of the packaging first. That would have been smart. And this is what it looks like. Ooh, this is how it comes out, and let's go ahead and wrap it in. I just washed the cleanser off. That is honestly if not the most soft, the softest cleanser I have ever used on my skin. It was so nice and pleasant and I love the smell of the cucumber because it's not like it's anything fragrance, which it shouldn't be, it's skincare. But it was just pleasant to use on the skin. Like I feel when I was like rubbing it in and everything, I felt like my skin was actually like 
gonna feel fresh afterwards and everything and I felt really fresh I felt very clean it has a really nice cucumber scent but it's like a natural cucumber it's nothing fragrancy um, and I really like this and I can see by the textures you guys can see how jelly it was I can see why it removes makeup so well and it definitely did get rid of the excess makeup that I had on my eyes on my lower lash line and on my skin my skin feels very very soft right now and my shirt is wet but we're gonna move on to the next step so for the next step I have here the rose deep hydration facial toner Oh, it's just so pretty in there and I love toners in general so I'm kind of excited to see what this one has so basically this is a non stripping formula it minimizes pores oh I didn't even realize that okay it minimizes pores and increases hydration with hyaluronic acid and real rose petals which like I said I'm obsessed with like roses and rose water when it comes to skincare so I'm hyped about this so the benefits um, this is an alcohol-free formula, has an unmatched amount of rose power, toning rose fruit extract, soothing rose water, nourishing rose oil, and real floating rose petals. It's just so beautiful. Oh. It hydrates and clears your skin of leftover impurities, leaving it silky, soft, and prepped for the product you apply after. Um, it has rose fruit extract and it's known for toning properties. Rose water helps to soothe and rose flower oil helps to nourish. Hyaluronic acid attracts and maintains moisture to enhance suppleness. She's going to be supple. And lastly, angelica leaf extract helps to retain moisture. So, let's see what she's about. I've been recently loving my Tula toner, so I'm interested to see, but I, these are two different types of toners. The Tula one is more of a gel, so I think it all just depends. If I like this one, on like how I'm feeling that day. I'm like, okay, who am I gonna use today? Am I using Miss Tula or Miss Fresh? Because Miss Fresh looks like she's coming to take over Miss Tula. I don't know. This is what it looks like. I can't get that plastic off, I really don't care. I'm gonna take a cotton ball. From my little bowl of cotton balls. I feel like everybody should have a bowl of cotton balls. And I'm gonna take some. Okay, so this is what it looks like on the cotton ball. So it's like brownish. And I'm gonna just take that all over the skin. It smells like rose water. And I love that. So another thing that I really like about toner is that when you go after it, when you go into it after your cleanser, it'll show you like what your cleanser didn't take off. And you guys remember the color of the cotton ball when I showed you guys what the toner looked like on there and this is what it looks like after. So there was a little bit of makeup but nothing crazy and I really like that because that means that the cleanser really cleansed my skin the way it was supposed to and that's of course what we want. It is a cleanser. I like this rose rose water toner a lot I love rose water and the fact that it even has like pore minimizing effects too I think I'm gonna probably reach for this one more um, especially when I'm doing in-depth skincare so I really really like that one I'm gonna take a water break because water is good for the skin too okay get your water cheers all right next step I have here a mini version of the fresh rose deep hydration oil infused serum so this serum is the fastest way to dewy skin with a few shakes two potent phrases transform into a silky serum balancing water and oil giving thirsty skin exactly what it needs very interested to see that because I don't I don't necessarily have dry skin or oily skin. I kind of really have normal to combo, but I want my skin to have a natural radiance to it. I want to glow. I don't want my skin to look dull, so I want to glow. So I want to see if this is going to help me with that. Also, it is with rose water, damask rose, and lightweight nourishing oils. It helps deeply hydrate for 24 hours without a greasy finish, which I'm 100% interested in. Key ingredients include water face, um, rose water and damask rose extract help 
to soothe and hydrate. Um, oil phase, a blend of skin friendly oils, rose flower, carmelina, rose hip, and squalene. Uh, rose water helps to calm and soothe. Damask, rose, damask, like damask, rose extract hydrates and smooths and squalene helps to protect more and moisture skin. Squin skin. I heard somebody say squalene today, but I thought it was squalene, but um I guess I've been wrong this whole time. This is so cute. Okay, sorry. Anyways. Oh I got some on the hands like this. Oh my god this smell oh I love just a really beautiful natural scent and it just smells like all of the key ingredients like the rose the cucumber like oh this is amazing and as you see as I'm putting it on the skin it's not too um oily Although it is a serum, I especially need it on my nose because my nose tends to be drier than the rest of my skin for some reason. My nose wants to be dry. Oh my god, that nerd. Oh my gosh, that softened my nose up so nicely. Wow. This serum is amazing. This serum is good. Oh wow, okay. Mm. I'm kind of mad that I'm falling in love with expensive skincare. Like. No. And lastly, I'm going to go ahead and get into the Fresh Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream. So, this face cream is a lightweight moisturizer that delivers 72 hour deep hydration in three weeks. A duo of hyaluronic acids instantly and deeply hydrate while time release technology delivers continuous hydration. Damask Rose Extract strengthens the skin's barrier, resulting in dewy skin that's plumped with moisture. And um, it's scientifically proven to strengthen the skin's barrier for 24 hours. Key ingredients includes, includes damask rose extract that retains moisture and strengthens the skin's barrier. A duo of hyaluronic acids deliver instant and deep hydration. And time release technology delivers continuous hydration on the skin surface. Let's try her out. It doesn't really have a scent. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna take some of what's like on the cap because uh, we don't waste product in this household. And I'm gonna, oh my goodness. <laughs> this is gorgeous. When I say gorgeous, um, oh my, whoa, whoa. Okay, hold on, I'm, I'm genuinely shocked. Whoa. Whoa. Like, I'm shook. So immediately when I got it on my finger, it was very, it was thick but soft. And then once I rubbed it in, it almost rubbed in like water. And then it applied so nice. I felt like I was falling into like a silk pillow. Like, oh my goodness. That's gorgeous. No, no, no. Hold on. This was good. That was great. Okay. Oh my god, it just instantly hydrated the skin without making it too oily. And I feel like I have a nice, like, natural glow. And I feel like my skin looks kind of like awake. It doesn't look too dull. It doesn't look dull at all, actually. It just looks like normal. Normal. And my, and what my opinion of normal would be for my skin. Um, and I like that. Like, normal, but like better than my normal. I'm shocked. This is. Let me share my thoughts. Okay really like the fresh skincare line um i was pleasantly surprised i was a little nervous because you know we always like to stick to what we know when it comes to our skincare and i really wanted to try it because i got these products and i love them the soy face cleanser is such a cool based like it literally comes off as like a makeup cleanser but a face cleanser at the same time like it comes out like this gel like this loose gel it's so good the toner is absolutely amazing i love rose water for the skin so anything with rose water is gonna be a win for me but especially when it really works i'm absolutely obsessed i really like that serum too i'm like oh my god my bank account's gonna hate me for the rest of my life because i fell in love with fresh skincare but the serum was so good i'm gonna make that little thing last and I honestly have to say my favorite thing, my favorite discovery today was the face cream. It just felt like I splashed my face with water. And it just, and it dried into the skin so nicely now, like, oh my goodness. 
I guys, I see the hype behind fresh skincare. If you guys want to try it out, I definitely would. Um, try out some sample sizes beforehand. There's no harm in that. You feel me? Like, if you want to spend some coin and you want to try some fresh skincare, like, 100%. People who are raving about it are not lying. Like, I'm here to tell you, they're not lying. I absolutely love it. Um, I'm I'm very impressed. I like how I have two different types of toners now. I have really more of like a water, watery toner and a gel toner. So I kind of have that option. Um, I'm very, very, very happy. This cleanser, I see why people love it. But this cream... Chef's kiss, like fresh, you did that. But I absolutely love this. I'm gonna continue to use this and if my thoughts and feelings change, I'll definitely update you guys because I mean, it's only fair that I do so. I mean, I filmed a whole review, like I have to update you on the good, the bad, and the ugly of it. So, I will do that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. If you did, don't forget to like this video, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel for more. Let me know some products you guys want me to try down below, and I will try my best to get my hands on them. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye!